shoot. It's Spark. I'm sorry, but I was going to die if I didn't let go. Yo, yo, yo! Good morning, everyone! Welcome back to another vlog here in the Mo Vlogs family. Before today's vlog starts, I just want to say, if you're new around here, click the subscribe button. What are you guys doing? So I'm going to get straight into it because I'm sure most of you have clicked on this video for the same reason. And I'm not going to play around with you guys. We have finally made the decision as a family. We're going to be selling my Mustang. Yeah. Goodbye, Musty. You go hug your child. <laughs> So there you go, I finally took delivery of my car. It looks super mean. What? You guys don't realize how much I love my Mustang. This car has been with me through everything, like through the start of my YouTube channel until now. But honestly guys, we just don't drive this car anymore and I feel bad leaving it without doing anything. Like the car has just been sitting here for months and months. Now here is the thing, honestly this car has been sitting here for so long, the battery has died. So right now, it's time to start up the engine. Nothing happens. The battery is dead like oh Okay, here we go boys. It's time to switch on the Mustang So basically we're gonna use the Rolls-Royce engine to start up the Mustang guys because the battery is dead on that That is positive and that's negative, huh? Yeah, I think I'm I'm, I'm, I'm not sure at this point. bro. You're gonna kill someone right now okay, let's do this. I've got the clippers here we go. Oh my god guys. This is not a good idea, right? Yeah, the car's off. Here we go. Do you even know what you're doing? I think. Guys, my sister is about to destroy my car. Uh oh. I'm not very sure about this one. So we're gonna just test it out. Bro, this is such a bad idea. <laughs> Guys, my sister has no idea what she's doing. Don't touch it with your hand. Shit, I'm so sorry, did I hit you? It sparked. Yeah. That almost flew into my face. I know, sorry. Bro, that almost flew into my face. Yo, yeah, bro, that's really. I'm not. Are you? You do it. I'm not doing it. Bro, what the hell are you doing? It's sparks. I'm not gonna touch that. I'm sorry, but I was going to die if I didn't let go. No, you weren't. Yeah, but I had to throw it away. I was gonna electrocute myself. Holy moly, this is not a good idea. Yo, if the car blows up, I'm, I'm, I'm back, guys. I'm back. Your car is making a noise. What is that noise? I don't know. Guys, this is making a really weird noise. I don't think this is a good idea. You know what? We don't even need to turn it on. They can do it when they're taking the car. Yeah. Anyways, guys, the point is we're setting the Mustang today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to touch that wire now. <laughs> I can't do it, bro. It's so scary. Why is it doing that? Can we just not do this anymore? <gasps> oh. No. I think it's charging. Wait, what just happened? Guys, my car just turned on. Oh! It worked! Oh, it worked! It just needed time. It just needed time. Yes! It's alive! Oh, she's alive, guys. The, the car's alive! I'm gonna miss it, though. That's the only Anyways guys, the car is alive again. It's alive. As I said, you guys don't even realize how much I love the Mustang. It is my baby, guys, but I feel like it's time to get rid of it. So today, I'm gonna go and see how much they'll buy it for. Like, I don't even know. Oh boy. Yeah, how much do you think they'll buy it? I'm not sure. A few moments later. <laughs> I hate you. All right, boys, so check it out. We are finally here, and I'm at Deals on Wheels, and you already know we got the owners. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with Mohammed and Rashid's also Why? here. Bro, I want to sell the Mustang. You know why I'm here. Yes, you, you're here for the cash, right? I'm here for the cash. Yeah, I got the cash ready right in here. Okay, he, he said he's going to make me an offer cash for the car right now, so... Okay, let's, so let's have a little game, all right? I'm gonna give you two bundles of cash and you're gonna choose one of them. Okay. Alright. Alright. Let's do this. Damn guys, he's got the money ready in the safe right now. So what do you prefer? Dirhams or dollars? Whichever one of them has a little more money. So you just have to try and see if you can detect which one has more. And that's the money for and my that's car. The offer for your Ford, for your Mustang. Okay, okay, I'm gonna pick this. That's Bam. Alright, dollars. Okay, which one was the more? So this was twenty-five thousand dollars. 
And this is 100,000 dirhams, which is equivalent to $27,000. No. So, so I won today. No, can I have that offer back? <laughs> I love the fact that they have every currency here. So that's 10,000. 20,000, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and that's 5,000. Done. Done deal. Alright. Bam. Congrats. So tomorrow you're taking the car? Yeah, today. I'm on the car right now. Oh, okay. I'm gonna send the recovery right now to collect it. The car is officially sold and a lot of you are wondering how much I'm gonna get for the car. This is actually pretty good. I can use it to buy a new car. Oh yeah. Guys, I did it. I did it. I sold the Mustang. I sold the Mustang. Oh <gasps> No. Alright guys, well there you go. As you can see, I finally sold the Mustang. I don't know how to feel right now guys. Like honestly, I'm happy that the car is gonna go to a new owner. But as I said, that was my baby guys. So like it's it, you know when you're connected to something and you just woo! All right, the Mustang is out of the way, guys. Anyways, right now I've come over to this really cool store they have over here in the mall, and I'm actually going to buy a cotton candy maker. Yes, this. A. So they actually have a really cool cotton candy maker, and I love cotton candy, so I feel like this would be something amazing for my kitchen. Imagine making yourself cotton candy every day. Like, it's probably not really healthy for you, like, yeah, it's probably a bad idea doing this, but I'm quickly buying it right now, and once I get home, I want to see how big we can make the cotton candy, so, yeah. Whoa, guys, look at it. Oh my god, we are buying a cotton candy machine. Woo! <laughs> okay, so now that I'm home, guys, I'm here with my sister, and it's time to test out my new cotton candy maker. Alright, here we go, guys. Yeah, hold it. Okay. Oh, it even comes with the sticks. <laughs> Guys, I'm not sure how this works exactly, but we're gonna figure it out. So here you go, boys. This is a cotton candy maker. And as soon as you turn it on, whoa. Guys, look at it. So there is actually like a heater under there. Right now, we're actually gonna mix some food coloring with the sugar to get some colored candy floss. What? What are you doing, bro? You said mix the food coloring with sugar, yeah? Yep. And then, uh, do we just pour it in? Yeah, I think we just pour it in. Oh. Bro. Um. Are you sure about this? Um, I think we just destroyed it. No. What are you doing? <laughs> Guys, it's working. Do you see that? We're making cotton candy! <laughs> bro, wait, it's chucking it around. What the hell is it doing? What the hell? Guys, what is happening right now? It's chucking the cotton candy on the side. Okay, wait, 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 guys. I think we've completely messed up right now. Do you want to eat this? <laughs> this is the worst cotton candy maker. Bro, you want to test it out? No, I don't want to test it out. It's full of sugar. I think you put too much food coloring. Okay, let me try it one more time. Take this. I'm going to mix the blue. Take this. So we're going to do it again, guys. But I think the first time we put too much food coloring. So we're going to do blue now. Be careful. I think we just need one drop. Boom. Basically, you take the sugar, okay, and you pour it in there, okay? I don't know what's happening right now, but my sister has figured it out apparently. Whoa! Guys, check it out! So if you guys can see, it's actually working. It's like a tornado of sugar. Yeah. What? Guys, do you see that? Honestly, looking at it, it's so cool because it's like a little spider web. So basically what you do is you keep it off and then you start it. This is so cool. <laughs> we have a home cotton candy machine. Like, are you seeing this? Guys, Lana is a professional cotton candy maker. Okay. Now you can send me money in PayPal. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that, now I will try it. that looks like the worst cotton candy I've seen. Amazing. Try it. You just tasted it, you liar. Yeah. Let's taste what my sister made, okay? It actually tastes good. It tastes like cotton candy, guys. <laughs> hey! Anyways, there you go, boys. That is our cotton candy maker. Now, here's the thing. If this video hits 50,000 likes, let's make the biggest cotton candy in the world. Oh, my God. That would be crazy. Like a room full of cotton candy. Like a human 
human-sized one. A human-sized cotton candy? Yeah. All right, guys, like this video right now, and we will use this to make the biggest cotton candy in the world. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. Hey, high five. Boom. <laughs>